Hi everyone, in front of me I've got Samsung Galaxy A16 5G and let me show with you how to change the keyboard language on this device. So let's start with opening the app which will provide you with the keyboard. So for example, messages, notes, browser, whatever, just have the keyboard on the screen like here and all we have to do is to enter the settings. So let's tap on them, they should be in this upper panel. Now let's tap on languages and types and uh, here we have to enter manage input languages. Let's tap on it. As you can see uh, here we've got the list of all um, all languages which are available. Those with the switchers are the languages which are let's say installed and here under it you've got the list of available languages which means that you can simply tap on this download icon and your device will um, download the specific uh, keyboard. So uh, all we have to do is to uh, add the language is to find it and tap on the switcher. So let me choose Arabic just tap on the switcher as you can see it is active and after getting back we can see that we've got three uh, languages added before I had Russian, uh, English and now our Arabic uh, language. What is more, uh, we've got this option, language switching method, which will appear after adding new language. Uh, let's tap on it. Basically, you can choose how you want to change the language on the keyboard. So spacebar swipe, uh, language key or both. And I will choose both options to show you how to do it. Because before I'll show you how to remove the previous language, I'd like to Mm, I'd like to show you how to use the keyboard actually. Uh, so now uh, all we have to do is to either tap on this language key, so the globe icon, which will allow us to change the language quickly, or if you prefer, you can simply swipe on the uh, spacebar. So you can also quickly change the keyboard layout. To remove the previous language, simply tap on this um, settings icon again, tap on the languages and types, and here mm, we have to tap on manage input languages again. So enter this long list and here either um, turn on or off uh, previous languages. So let me remove Arabic and Russian also. I don't need them. Let me go back. And as you can see, we do not have the globe icon, which means that we just successfully removed uh, previous languages and we've got only one language applied. All right. So that will be all. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that this video was helpful. And if it was, please hit the subscribe button and leave the thumbs up. Thank you.